In this video, we'll demonstrate SATCOM communications through two disparate radio systems. To accomplish this, we will use our Starlink high-performance antenna connected from our Motorola radios over to the Starlink network, over to our Radius Cloud server. Additionally, we have another configuration of radios using our Radius endpoint connected off camera to a Harris military tactical radio. To accomplish this, we're going to need a few components. First, we have our mobile radio with our portable APX radio. I'm going to transmit from the field to the mobile. The mobile radio will send the audio to the radius endpoint. The endpoint will convert that to IP, connect it to my Starlink antenna, up and out to the world. So in this case, when I transmit from the portable, I will receive it on my radius client and you'll hear quick, clear audio at the client level. So when I transmit from my portable, check one, two, three, four, five, five, four, three, two, run. I see the receive audio on my client workstation, and from the workstation, I can PTT to the radio Check one, two, three, four, five. So this configuration might be on a vehicle, on a boat, somewhere on a mountain that's far across wherever in the world I want to communicate to this particular network here. Now I might have a second network like I have here with my Harris Tactical configurations. In this case, when I transmit, receive on my workstation, check one, two, three, four, five, my tactical channel is illuminated. Likewise from here, if I want a PTT, check one, two, three, four, three, two, one. And so if I want to interoperate these two radio systems together, I can do so quickly and easily by creating a patch within the radius client. To do this, pick the patch function, the radios I want to connect, and confirm the patch. Now I've created an interoperated net between these two radio systems. Now, when I transmit from my portable radio, check one, two, three, four, five, five, four, three, two, one, I receive that on my tactical radio. Check one, two, three, four, five, five, four, three, two, one. As the operator, I can easily communicate to the radios, or I can communicate to the interoperated group by simply pushing the push to talk. Check one, two, three. And broadcast broadcasting out to the radios that are connected. If I want to remove the net, pick the break function, pick the center node, remove it. Again, if I want to create that patch, do so quickly and easily, like so. This might be a temporary patch that's set up. If I needed a long-term patch that might just exist on a day-to-day -day basis, I can create a channel whereby I drag and drop the assets to the channel, give it a name. Now I've created a channel that is interoperated with both radios. So now on a day-to-day -day basis, if they might communicate, check one, two, three, four, five. Good copy, check one, two, three, four, five. To the operator, it's seamless communications regardless of the radio system they're communicating on. 